Well, hello. How are you doing? Several of you have been asking about Edie. I've had several emails every month from people asking about Edie and what it's like to live here, what the facilities are, how to get supplies, coal and food onto the island and what is there to do and if I can show you some of the local scenes and scenery of this wonderful island. So I thought today I'm going to go and take you lot on a wee adventure. I'm going to take you to one of my favourite places on the island. It's an old, old kirk right on the seashore on the east side. It's called Our Lady's Kirk or St Mary's Kirk. There's a few different names for it. But it is a ruined church dating all the way back to medieval times, which was rebuilt in mid-1700s, then ruined and then rebuilt again and then ruined again. And then the current church, well, one of the current churches, there's six ruined churches on the island in total. One is still in use, so it's not ruined. So there's, so there's quite a few churches on the island that are in various states of decay. But this is probably one of my favourite places. It's right on the seafront and it's so windswept, atmospheric, dense in atmosphere. I love it there. I often go there for a a bit of quiet contemplation, a bit of rugged peacefulness. It's so windswept, the gravestones, the markers are magnificent. Some of the gravestones are covered in moss and really becoming weathered. This rough beauty to them, which to me sums up Edie and Orkney in general. It's a rough state of being, yet beautiful. And you really have to see it up close to really appreciate the fine beauty of the raw state. So anyway, come with me and take you for a quick whirlwind tour around my favourite spot on Edie. St Mary's Church, Our Lady's Kirk, or otherwise known as the Old, Old, Old Kirk. So come on, let's go for a drive and I'll see you down there. See you soon.